Hello Cancer, welcome to my channel. My name is Isabel from the tarotempress.com. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading now, focused on your love life. This is going to be looking at new love. If you're interested in knowing whether anybody new is coming into your life, you know, then this is going to be the reading for you. Sometimes there can be overlapping energies that are coming through from some of your exes that might want to come back into your life so do keep an open mind okay if you want a personal reading you can get it at the tarotempress.com so the very first card that i have is indicating potential new love that is on the horizon again this could be representing somebody coming back from the past as well wanting to have another chance at a relationship with you okay so it appears as if someone that you're dealing with is potentially heartbroken, okay? I'm picking up the energy of someone that um, may have been hurt as a result of a relationship that occurred at some point in the past, okay? So I'm picking up from the cards that um, this person could be wanting to come back into your life. Right, so that's a very interesting combination of cards that have come up. I feel like there's a very strong, strong obsession that this individual may have for you. Okay, so that's one of the possibilities, or perhaps two if you have a very lusty connection. There's a lot of temptation, desire, and uh, sexual energy that is you know pulling the two of you together, and you can't understand it, they can't understand it. The two of you lust after one another, want to be together. It's the type of connection that, uh, you know, is fueled by passion, fueled by excitement, fueled by lust. And, um, you know, I feel like this individual hasn't gotten over you, potentially. That's why they think about you all the time. And uh, there's a sense of resentment that they have inside of their heart about the fact that the two of you are not together right now. But that's completely normal, especially if you have a very deep connection with someone you know, you'll resent the fact that things didn't work out or perhaps things are a little bit strained in the relationship. The next card is showing to me confusion and not being able to see what is real versus what is not real. There's this energy of trying to figure out, you know, whether or not the two of you can entertain the fantasy that both of you have in your hearts for one another. There is in fact, a very strong fantasy, a very strong desire to be together, a strong desire to want each other, right? Now, I feel like when the two of you uh, were together at uh, one point, right, there's this energy of, you know, having a sense of contentment, having a sense of satisfaction, about uh, meeting one another you know so there were some good times there were a lot of pride and a lot of um, excitement and joy that was connected to what the two of you share with each other right so i do feel like that energy is coming out very strongly now the next energy that i'm picking up on is showing to me that yeah there's something big that is happening in the background of the situation. I feel like there's still so much unresolved energy. There's still so much um, love in the situation, right? The two of you are on some sort of journey. And this journey is, you know, indicating to me that uh, both you and this individual have uh, yet to understand how strong and powerful you know, the love is between the two of you. So I do sense 
from the energies that, you know, take a closer look at this connection. Ask yourself those questions like, um, you know, how can the two of you build upon this relationship? How can the two of you, uh, you know, nurture this love, nurture this relationship? Because there is this very, very powerful, you know, love that is occurring there. Let's look at the next energy. Okay, for some of you, you could be dealing, well, there's a range of zodiac signs. Well, it doesn't have to be limited to just one. It could be, you know, it could be Aries, Sag, Leo. I'm also picking up the Capricorn energy. There's also Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius coming out. And I'm seeing, for some of you, Sag energy, right? Wow, okay. So I'm seeing that in this situation, a lot of, uh, energy has been put into this relationship and this is something that uh, goes with the territory in terms of what the two of you are striving for now let's figure out right where this confusion is coming from I feel like there's an uncertainty of whether or not you feel the same way towards them. So I feel like this individual is questioning if you still care about them deeply, if you still want to be with them. They have these type of questions inside of their mind, okay? So I am getting the impression that this individual is uh, wondering, you know, if you uh, still want to be with them, if you still you know, think of them, if you uh, care about them in the same way, have the situation changed, you know, these are the type of things that they're trying to figure out in light of the relationship, okay? Now, I see that there's emotions here that are very trapped, and that needs to change, because I feel like the two of you are confused about your place in each other's life, and... Uh, there is this uh, sort of idea that you may have lost your position in uh, their, you know, in their life. And I feel like um, this individual is scared of you either moving on or finding uh, some sort of relationship with another individual. There is that, you know, indication that there's a, a fear underneath there, you know, an insecurity that this individual hasn't been able to contend with, right? And this has happened as a result of an ending or a breakup potentially. So these fears are making this individual feel very, very confused to the point where they don't know if, you know, you still want them or, you know, if you have lost interest. These are the kind of things that this individual is thinking about in the back of their mind, right? So let's look at the next energy. Yeah, I feel like the two of you um, cannot walk away from each other. Absolutely cannot walk away from each other. Someone could be waiting to get back together with you. Yeah, I feel like someone can't walk away. And um, they do feel very emotional. I am picking up the energy of this individual feeling very emotional and fearful that, you know, they might not be able to get over what the two of you share with one another and uh, that frightens them a great deal. I do feel like it makes them feel uh, very intimidated by the fact that you might, um, you know, perhaps not want to be with them or that you may have 
you know, lost interest. I feel like a lot of fears and insecurities, but there's also this indication that this individual is waiting or willing to, um, you know, wait and see what happens. And if the two of you are able to come back together, I do feel like a lot of happiness is in store here because I'm seeing like major joy, major success and potentially, you know, marriage or commitment happily ever after or, you know, the sense of um, satisfaction beyond your wildest dreams. So, yeah, some big things could happen if the both of you were to get back together. Right. I hope you guys enjoyed your tarot card reading. If you want a personal reading, you can get it at the tarotempress.com. Have a wonderful day and take care.